is Strictly Shirley is with us now. After Caroline Quentin, she became the fourth celeb to leave the show last night, uh, following some quite incredible performances on Saturday. Well, Shirley joins me now. It's lovely to see you, Shirley. How are you doing? Hello. Oh, no. Can you hear me? Oh, no. Hello, I can hear you. Yay! See, that? that's it. That, that's like when you have a Zoom call at home and you're like, hello. <laughs> hello. Shirley, can I just say, first of all, watching you in this series, I really feel as if you're really owning it. You know, you're enjoying it. I mean, listening to all of your comments and it's just like you are having a ball and it's lovely to watch. I've had an absolutely amazing time. I think I've really settled into it now. This is my fourth series. And I just think I feel really comfortable. And Craig and, of course, Anton and Motsi, my, my girlfriend, you know, it's a, it's been amazing. And all the celebrities. It switched. really works. It really works. And, of course, in these horrible times, do we all need a bit of Strictly? I mean, you know, the, the, I mean, so many people, obviously it was so successful anyway, but it's just come at the right time, hasn't it? It's come at the right time because we've all been in this lockdown and, you know, people have had anxiety and stress. And I think our baubles, bangles and beads brighten <laughs> up everybody's day on uh, when we have Strictly. They do, they certainly do. You must be getting that as well from people, you know, just from members of the public getting in touch. I mean, I know we, we're not out and about seeing everybody right now, but just from, you know, the, the response from emails and texts and Twitter and social media. Well, on my social media, it's actually gone off the chart and I've had uh, some beautiful comments, lots of direct messages, uh, lots of people sharing different things, even their cooking skills for me. So <laughs> I've actually enjoyed the social media journey this time, believe it or not. Which is good. I'll tell you what, though, this time there's, I don't know, there's no bad dancers. That It's a really high standard, isn't it? <laughs> it's it's. The hardest, toughest series, yeah, as you yeah. can see as we go into these weeks, sending anybody home is, com is so difficult. I can just urge everybody, please vote, make my job easy. Because <laughs> everybody has a favourite. Everyone has a favourite. I know. Who have you got your eye on? Who has really impressed you? You know, they've all impressed me, but I think Jamie Lang this week just yeah. blew my socks off. I wasn't expecting that. And as for Bill Bailey, I mean, well, he's just something else, isn't he? But they're all good. I mean, JJ, Chalmers with Amy, uh, they're just all great. They are, I mean, they're really good. I have to say, obviously, here we are obsessed with our Ranveer. And she, for me, is what the show is all about because she had no dance experience. And look at her. It's just a joy to watch. It's incredible. Well, let me tell you, Ranveer was all sizzle this weekend. There was a sensuality about the female movement. There was something special in the chemistry between the two of them. It was like they were just in a room all of their own and we were able to look in the windows and enjoy it. She is sensational. She really could is. be the dark horse, by the way. I she think could be so. the one that just, you know... Yeah. Don't watch out there. Well, if she keeps improving, and that's what we love to see. We love to see people getting better and better and getting more and more confident on the on the dance floor. It's just it's just a joy to see. It really is. Now, look, earlier on this week, we were talking to your Craig, and I know the two of you have teamed up to have a look at some of the, well, the golden moments of Strictly. So we did the DVD together. We went back in time, and I was asking him, would he change his mind about giving different scores? We saw some magnificent dancing. I mean, he is very difficult to change his mind. Once Craig's made up his mind, he's made up his mind and that's it. You know, but I uh, had the most spectacular day with him and going back through the historic moments of the show was a joy. I really think people are going to enjoy that DVD for sure. Absolutely. For you, I mean, there's so many standout moments. It must have been really difficult to, to choose. Well, I, I, I love Anne Whittacombe. I, I, I just thought she will go down in history. I thought she gives everything 100% and she just doesn't care. She's going to do her thing, a little samba. She was amazing. And then, of course, there was another puppet number that we had from Giovanni and his yes. beautiful partner. I love that. And who can ever forget Gangnam Style? Oh, I my mean, goodness. Yeah, we're seeing Faye doing the puppety one. That was that amazing, Faye, wasn't it? That, well, that'll go down in history. That was just absolutely iconic. Really so this whole DVD just goes way down the history channels and everybody was going to 
thoroughly enjoy watching it. I think it. we've all we've all got those special moments that we we just really loved, and it's just a show that makes us feel better. It must be just so lovely to be part of that. And listen, I have to ask you, how are you? Because you broke your ankle. Are you okay? Are you able to? I mean, you look absolutely fine. We can see you twirling around, so everything is okay. Well, I've got my last appointment for my foot next week, but I've also got a strained rotator cuff, which I'm trying on the show to, I'm using my left arm more than my right. <laughs> so oh, I'm getting that scene too. But yeah, lockdown was, you know, a little stressful and a bit of anxiety going on there, gained some weight, which I'm still trying to get off like everybody else yeah. in the country, you know, so uh, yeah. Well, you look good on it. I'll tell you when we see you every Saturday night, you look fantastic. But isn't it true? I mean, we were just talking about that with Maxine. I mean, she's a fitness instructor, for goodness sake, and she put weight on. So I don't think we should beat ourselves up too much. But it's just making sure it doesn't tip over, isn't it? Because we all know our limit when you're when the wow. when the clothes are getting too tight, <laughs> which they are I from you right now. I was learning to cook, but I was eating everything morning, noon and night. So I think that was my issue. That was the highlight of my day when my meals. <laughs> I know we have to we have to be so careful, but I think we're allowed. Now, look, Shirley, behind the sequins is out right now. And this is a, what a life you're having. It's fantastic. I mean, there's ups, there's downs, but you know what? You really are an incredible woman. The resilience is extraordinary. <laughs> Well, it was definitely a difficult book to write. I'd been asked to write it a long time ago and I decided not to, but I went on this journey all the way back from childhood. I wanted people to get a grasp of my life, not as they see me on the show, but how my life really was to get to where I am now. I hope it's a very inspiring journey from a little girl from a housing estate who hit this great height of being on Strictly and, and inspiring so many people. So I'm really hoping that people will enjoy this journey. It definitely got ups and downs. It's definitely mar lots of marriages and engagements and this and that and all the drama that goes with it. My brother's suicide and uh, yes, it's, it's a really meaty story. So I hope people enjoy it. It really is. And you're in a good place right now. Like I say, you've, you know, you're you're entrenched and strictly, you're having the time of your life. You and Danny are together. Things are good. Things are good. They are good. And today we're going to have our, all the Christmas decorations are going up today for the first time in 17 years. So I'm very, very happy. Wayfair are going to put trimmings up to help me with my house. So that's that's huge step forward for me. And you're allowed. You're allowed to do it early. That's what I say. For goodness sake, let's just do it. Shirley, a joy to talk to you. See you on Saturday. Oh, you you will be you. looking gorgeous and lovely. I will be in my grey tracksuit, but that's fine. <laughs> Thank you, my love. Thank you so much. Great to see you. And Strictly's DVD, Strictly Come Dancing, Shirley and Craig's Perfect Ten is out today. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.